right, so the first thing I wanna talk about is how Google Ads actually work and why they are so powerful. I know many of you already know this, but I want us to all start at the same page and I want us to talk about the same things later on in the tutorial. So let's say I'm in the market for a new wooden watch because my friend likes wooden watches, I wanna get one for him for his birthday. So I go to Google and I type in wooden watch. Wooden watch is my keyword. People type in keywords into the Google search bar. And then Google gives me search result based on what I type in the search bar. So these are the search results that come up for me personally when I type in wooden watch. So when we take a closer look at those search results, we notice that here in the front of the URL that comes up is add. So it says add in front of the URL, which means that somebody paid to appear here on the first page of Google when somebody types in wooden watch. The same thing with the second search result, it also says add. When we take a uh, look at the third search result, you see that it doesn't say add in front of the URL, which means that this one is an organic search result. So nobody paid to appear here on the search result. The person who owns this website is just, or this website is what Google thinks is most relevant to my search here to my keyword that I typed into Google. So here for this specific keyword, we have two ads and then we have the first organic search results. When you go to the second page of Google or when you scroll all the way down to the first page, you might see even more ads or on some pages you also see shopping ads where you see specific products on the top of Google. But in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you exactly how to set up one of these ads here so how you can pay to appear in front of um, people when they type in specific keywords that are related to what you are offering, to your specific product. Now, why, now what happens when somebody clicks on your ad? So what happens when, when I would click on this specific website? Well, for me, as somebody who's just looking for a wooden watch, I don't really notice that this is an ad because I will just land on the online shop of this specific um, website, which is Truewood. And then I can go and I can buy my watch. But for the advertiser who put this ad here, they will have to pay for my click. So with every click that gets, uh, with every click that this ad gets, they might pay 50 cents, they might pay a dollar, they might pay two dollars or even four dollars, depending on what they are bidding and depending on how, what Google says and they should pay. But more on, on how this works with um, the how much you have to pay per click later in the tutorial. So let's say he, ha he pays $1 for every click that he gets on this ad. So um, for 50 clicks, he will pay $50. But let's say every 50 clicks, one of those people who clicks this, uh, this ad will buy a new watch. And um, for every watch that this store sells, they make a profit of, let's say, $80. So with every 50 clicks, they have to pay $50 to Google, but they make $80 back because they sell a watch. So they have a profit margin of $30. That's how you can um, that's how you can do good paid advertising on Google and profitable advertising. You just have to make sure that you, you, you get more back from the customers you get from your clicks than what you have to pay for your clicks. And throughout the tutorial, I will show you how to get the lowest cost possible for your clicks and the highest conversion rates. So um, why are Google Ads so powerful? Well, the reason is because there, are, there, is, there is buyer's intent behind specific keywords. So when we compare, for example, Facebook ads with Google Ads, it's an entirely different thing because on Facebook, let's say I'm just, I'm bored, I go to Facebook, I scroll, maybe I wanna see what my friends are doing, maybe I wanna see some funny cat videos. So I'm not very likely to go ahead and buy something. So when I see an ad of a leather watch, I'm not very likely to actually buy it. But with Google, when I type in modern leather watch, I'm ready to, I'm actually interested in a modern leather watch and probably in the market for it. Or when I, I type in a modern leather watch store, something like that, then I'm very likely to want to want to find a store and then I want to spend money at that store. So. Uh, these keywords are very valuable, so you can really put your offer, your service, your product in front of the people that are actually searching for what you're offering. That's why Google Ads are so are so powerful. And in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to set up a Google Ad for those specific keywords that are related to the product or to the service that you are selling. 